don't have any feeling one way or another about technology. I mean, if some medium turns me on somehow to do something, okay, but I wouldn't look for an unusual medium. The interest in many of these things is in the medium itself, and it's a kind of lure into a realm of interest rather than meaningfulness, if you can put it that way. To use the product is uh, the same thing as using a paintbrush. It, it isn't any more advanced than that. There's a romanticism connected with both the artist using technology and the scientist wishing he were an artist. It's a longing for something to be something you're not, in a way. Unlike most of my things, this is a sort of contemplative piece, and so it really wasn't meant for people rushing by. But what you're supposed to see is two screens, and they have in common a sky, a horizon line, and an ocean. And the horizon line in both of them moves back and forth as though you were on a boat viewing these things. But their two horizon lines are out of synchronization with one another. And um, it's kind of nice to watch both of them at once. incongruity between the sky and the water in both of them. It, it's, a, it's a play between uh, reality things and artificial things.